Hey guys, Jan here in the Northview Model Shop. Uh, as the title says, not so clear. Um, I've got a couple products that I've been trying out. The first one I bought was clear. Now, this might be my own problem, but this is a Krylon uh, Satin Clear. And when sprayed, let's see here, i got it right here. When sprayed, that's the wrong spoon. I'm going to find that this one here is the wrong spoon too. When sprayed, this was dark, now it's nice light. Um, I don't know what's going on with this, but the real big bummer was Andrew's car. I stripped it, but that's about the color that this one turned. And I, I'm thinking this is my problem, because this is a, a acrylic crystal clear, and then that was an enamel body, and it seems to me there's somewhere somebody was saying you never spray enamel over a clear, or not, uh, acrylic over an enamel, and I think that's what killed me. So. This stuff is not working. Anything I do with it, even when I'm using the Krylon and sprays, it's it's going right foggy. So I don't know what's going on with that. And if anybody knows Krylon Acrylic Crystal Clear, if this is a good product. I'm thinking it's not working for me. The next one is Dupacolor Acrylic Enamel Clear. Um, it looked great. Looked really great. Um, there's the Corvette hood after one coat. Um, didn't really, it fogged a little bit on me, but I didn't think too much of it. Here's the Corvette hood now, or the body, after two coats. As soon as I put the second coat on, it just, it bubbled. It started bubbling wicked bad. Turned the black, black Krylon to a paste. That was just right gummy. And I just, this, this, this car is going in the bucket, or in the box. It's going to stay there for a while, because I'm done dealing with it for the time being. The question now that I'm coming up to is clears. What are you guys using for clears? Um, I've always used uh, the testers. You know, uh, I don't know what they call it, one coat lacquer. And this has always worked really well, but you know, it's six or seven dollars for this little can, and it's seven dollars for this great big can. So I'm trying to find something better, right? You guys could help me. Um, even though, let me know what you use. Like I said, I predominantly in sprays will use a Krylon. I like the Krylon products, so I use that a lot. But this mixed with this equals this. And I think if even if you look at the spoon that I did a test spray on too, that should be a nice gloss black and it's really foggy and white. And I think even when I sprayed it, you could see the paint just starting to bubble. So anyway, guys, you know what I could do to help with this clearing issue? Let me know. I know Dave Parker, uh, he's got something that's kind of interesting to me. is just spray, wet sand, spray, wet sand, spray. And he's getting amazing results, so... That's something I want to try, but I'd like to know what you guys are doing clear-wise. So anyway, I just...